In Supercross racing, the start is the only opportunity you're gonna have to pass 21 riders at once. This is why having a fast and smooth launch off the gate will greatly improve your chances of getting to the checkered flag first. You know if you blew it off the start pretty much right away, because all you see is elbows on this side, elbows on this side, and you have this hallway that just keeps getting smaller and smaller and smaller. When the gate drops, you gotta think of reaction time. And then a big thing too that I practice is uh, making sure that I have my RPMs in the right spot. And making sure that my RPMs work together with my clutch release. The metal grate has been around since 2018 because it has so much traction, it can weigh your bike down. So you gotta make sure your clutch release is as smooth as your throttle delivery is. We go off the gray, get a lot of traction, we spin so much on the plastic, and then as the wheel spins and transitions to the dirt, it digs a hole. The less of a hole you have, the more forward drive you can get, the less the back suspension has to work, and the less likely you are of having to double clutch the motorcycle. As soon as that front tire goes up, the clutch is gonna have to get pulled in, and there goes your start. The start device, hold shot device, whatever you wanna call it, it basically holds the front end of the bike down. You want to have the momentum to be able to carry the front wheel just inches off the ground, just so you know that you're having all of that weight on the rear tire and putting as much power to the ground as you can. It doesn't necessarily always come from your reaction. If you get across the gate and you have just a really good drive, you can sometimes wiggle through guys a little bit whenever you get about you know 10 feet out of the gate. <laughs> 